Hi guys, it's Hobbybury4 here bringing you a uh, first time video on how to burn movie files onto a DVD on the Mac. Now, with the uh, older versions of the Mac, they came with a program called iDVD, which was able to burn movies. However, with the newer versions, which I've got today, and most of you most likely would have them as well, you don't have the program. So, the solution here is in, th in this video. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to go to the App Store and we are going to type in MIDVD, which I've already done, but just for your sake, I'm going to type in it again. And we are going to click on the free version. So download the free version, which mine already says installed because I've already installed it. And I'm just going to give you a quick run through um, why these two are good. So MIDVD Pro is $13 which gives you more customizations in the menu on your video which which is like like uh, music themes and um, you're able to burn more movies at once however with the MI DVD you can only burn one movie at once but I think for the price I think the free version is just fine so yeah once you've downloaded that that will be hopefully come up in the uh, dashboard here like mine but before we open that we're going to go to finder I'm going to go to the movies and I want you to get your video, movie, whatever and paste in here. Now with your video, make sure it's no bigger than 4.7 gig and it's no longer than 120 minutes because I think that's what the general capacity is for the DVDRs which we're going to put on to today. Um, yeah, so once you've done that, we're going to exit that and open up MI DVD making sure that you've got your movie in that file now once this is open it should look like this pretty simple not too complicated and what we're going to do we're going to go double click on the movies in the left hand bar here double click on it and your movie should come up here like so then we're going to drag that into this box here wait for that to load Yep, like so. Now, the only customization with this program is the title, I guess. Um, yep, that's pretty much it. So, I'm going to type in Life of Pi. I don't know what your movie is, but do that. Um, once you've done that, I'm going to go to Preview. I'm going to preview. This is just like a double check to make sure that before we burn it, it's going to be fire. So... If yours is like this or similar, and it, how you want it, you press quit or you can press stop, and you can move forward. But we're going to press quit once it decides to load. There we go. Quit. Now, once you've decided that's fine, we're going to plug in the DVD into your DVD little section. So you put your DVD in the Mac. Let that load. We're going to go to burn. And you're going to have two options. Now, the first option is burn DVD, which is like we're going to, like, you're going to put it onto a TV and watch it. Whereas burn ISO is kind of like the newer kind of stuff where you're going to watch it on your computer. It's kind of complicated to understand, but for our purpose, we're going to use burn DVD. Yep, just OK for that. We're going to burn DVD, and it's going to have all these different speeds. Now, the speed doesn't affect the uh, quality of the movie, but I always put it in maximum possible to get my movie finished downloading or burning. And we're going to have ver verifying burn data and eject disk after you've done it, or you can mount it on the desktop. Up to you, and we're going to press burn. I'm going to come up like this, and it will normally take about half an hour, depending on how long the video is. Um, you can press cancel if you want, and uh, that's pretty much it. Um, if you have any questions, please comment in the uh, comment section below, and um, please subscribe, and have a great day.